Hello everyone, my name is Connor and I am the founder of Crate. We are a digital agency that specializes in restaurant and hotel web design. Today I'm going to show you how to update your restaurant menu on a Squarespace website using Squarespace's menu block. To begin, we're going to navigate to one of our clients, the Powerhouse Eatery in Poconos, Pennsylvania, and we're going to go over to their menu page. We're going to look at editing their lunch menu. Once there, we're going to press ESC, Escape, in the top left of our keyboard. That'll evoke the login page where you'll enter your login credentials for your Squarespace website. Once in the back end of the website, the menu page will reappear and you'll be able to click the edit button on the page contents. Sometimes there's a little bit of a bug and if you can't evoke the edit button, I suggest going to pages and clicking on the page again to refresh it once logged in. Once you click edit, you're going to see that the menu is in a menu block. So you'll want to edit this menu block by clicking edit. Once you have the edit menu screen evoked, you'll see that Squarespace breaks the menus down into three categories. You have one category, which is the main menu, two, which is the subsection, and then three, which is the menu item. This appetizer bar here is considered a subsection. And to make something a subsection in a Squarespace menu, what you do is you put three dashes below it. Once you have three dashes below it, that organizes it into a subsection. Below the subsection, you have your menu items. You're going to want to make sure that each one of your menu items has a space between it and their price is included in addition to any description that you'd like to have provided. So the menu item title goes at top, description goes below, and price goes below description. Right now I'm going to show you how you can put multiple menus in one menu. So if a restaurant has a lunch and dinner menu or a breakfast, lunch and dinner menu, Squarespace has the capability to do that right within their menu editor. So I'm going to select this entire lunch menu and copy it. Now that I have it on my clipboard, I'm going to head over to the dinner menu, which is the most popular menu on this client's page. And we're going to add both the lunch and the dinner menu into the same page. So we're going to go through the same process by clicking edit on the page contents. Then we're going to click edit on the menu block. And now this time we're going to put in a title. So not a subsection but a title. So to do that we'll type in lunch and then use three equal signs instead of dashes. That'll create a lunch menu. We're also going to want to have a dinner menu which is the one that's already here. One, two, three, and now we have two menus. Now that I have the, the two menus, what I'm going to want to do is go ahead and copy and paste the lunch menu right on in there. Hit apply, hit save, preview the site, and here I have the lunch menu, and then here I have our dinner menu. So Squarespace menus are really easy to work with. The three things that you constantly have to remember are there's the header or the menu title, which is three equal signs. Then there's the subsections or basically appetizers, salads, entrees, which is three dashes. And then you want to remember that the menu item goes on top, description, price, and then leave a space before your next item. It's pretty much all you need to know to manage Squarespace menus. If you have any questions, please visit crate.co. That's www.krate.co and we can help you with any of your restaurant or hotel website needs. Thank you for your time.